Chris, and I'm back to react, and I feel a whole bunch better, except for the shit of a mic, and apparently, <laughs> another one I bought is shit too, but you know, that's bad luck as it is. Anyways, today, what we're gonna be reacting to is the one and only Spider-Man Far From Home official trailer, which I've responded to the teaser, and of course, I'm kind of wondering if I should stop doing teasers, but you know what? Say lovey, we're going to get into this and see how it is, and let's just freak out. The Spider-Man Far From Home trailer is about to play, but if you haven't Podcast. seen Avengers Endgame yet, stop Ted watching talk. because there's some serious spoilers about Saw to come. Saw it already. Up. I'm but good to go. If you have go. seen Avengers Endgame, enjoy the trailer. Thank you very much, Tom Holland. Everywhere I go, I see his face. Mm. I just really miss him. Yeah, I miss him too. I don't think Tony would have done what he did if he didn't know that you were going to be here after he was gone. That's true. He was the dad figure. You going to be the next Iron Man now? Well, no, I don't have time. I'm too busy doing your jobs. Oh. Oh. Okay, I'm kidding. Look, keep up the good work because I am going on vacation. Nice. Heads up. Nick Fury's calling you. I don't really want to talk to Nick Answer Fury. Phone. Why? Because if you don't talk to him, then I have to talk to him. I don't want to talk to him. <laughs> you sent Nick Fury to voicemail? I gotta go. You do not ghost Nick Fury. What up, dorks? What's up? We're just talking about the trip. I'm here in St. Marco Polo's. Oh, oh! I think MJ really likes me. That reminds me when I first fell in love. Oh, shit. Of You're course. You're a very difficult person lasers. to contact, Spider-Man. You, exactly. This is Mr. What? Beck. We could have used someone like you on my world. New world? Beck is from Earth, just not ours. A snap to our hole in our dimension. You're saying there's a multiverse? We have Obviously. a job to do, and you're coming with us. There's gotta be someone else. Sorry, I couldn't hear that new guy's um, name, so my apologies for that. Um... But yes, multi universe are a thing, damn it. It's a fucking theory. There's fucking sort of evidence, sort of conspiracy shit going on. Anyway, sorry, going back to this. You can use. What about Thor? Off world. Captain Marvel. Unavailable. But I'm just a friendly neighborhood Spider Man. Bitch, please, you've been to space. <laughs> what do you want, Peter? I want to go back on my trip with the girl who I really like and tell her how I feel. MJ, I am Spider Man. What? No, of course I'm not. I mean, it's kind of obvious. Oh my the god, how? Ready, but this is my responsibility. Saving the world requires sacrifice. I'm pretty sure I know Sometimes that superhero. Die. But I can't remember his fucking name! I just always feel like I'm putting my friends in danger. The world needs the next Iron Man. This fucking... First of all, this... That's cool. Second of all, this fucking mic is gonna fucking... Ugh! Gonna... Mm, no! Anyways, um... What was I saying? Alright, so there's Sandman. Sandman has appeared before, right? Right? I have to rewatch so many of these. Um... Waterman? Because he's not Aquaman. Waterman or whatever his name is. I remember him from the Spider-Man cartoon. Um, and that other guy, I have no fucking idea who he is, unless oh, these are all just monsters that hold no significance because they're just coming from another universe. Okay, that's what, the, anyways, continuing on. Are you going to step up or not? This is really, really good. What well, Marvel is good in general. I gotta get you guys out of here. Get on the jet. I work with Spider-Man. You work for Spider-Man? I work with Spider-Man, not for Spider-Man. <laughs> New plan. Oh my god. Okay. Okay. Yes, obviously I'm gonna see this. I'm super excited to see this. Spider-Man was my childhood hero, as I've mentioned countless times before. And I just, I just can't wait for this. MJ knowing that he's Spider-Man is like... Kind of. Well, MJ's supposed to be really, really smart. Well, wait, hold up. No, the original MJ is like a fucking whiny bitch. Who's indecisive? Sorry, not sorry. Um, But this one seems very intelligent and hopefully is not a whiny bitch. She actually seems like she can handle her damn own. And the whole theory and ideas of who's going to take over Iron Man's uh, legacy and empire is 
pretty much like they're saying spider-man they're saying his daughter in the future because the gen genetics um and also another person that was at his funeral at endgame that was seen in his earlier iron man movies so i'm just saying i'm pretty sure it's gonna be Spider-Man or his daughter, I don't know if they just wanted to put him for, like, um, you know, an Easter egg. But anyways, I can't wait to see this. Universes exist. I'm excited. I always say that, but I'm fucking excited. I saw Endgame. I did not review it for multiple reasons, and I'm not gonna review it. I'm just gonna say that it made me sob and cry, and it fucking made sniffling noises that a, a lot of people probably heard. And, uh, it was just amazing to me. And that poster was a fucking lie. Anyways, um, so thank you guys so much for watching me react to that. I went off in a little bit of a talent shit. And thank you guys, and I hope all you beautiful, unique, weird people have a beautiful, blessed day. And I'm out, so peace, everybody.